here today really just to have a look around. We've been invited. We're not doing any judging uh, today, so we're just purely guests. Have a look around it. Beautiful day. We've brought the nice weather with us, as you can see. And well, hopefully we're going to have a nice day. People are going to have a great enjoyment of animals. We love animals, as you're probably well aware. And uh, just hope everything goes well. Um, this is our seventh year now of running Capable Canines. We run it as an agility and a fun dog show for charity. It was set up in memory of one of my old dogs, Kim, who sadly passed away. We have a good turnout um, for the fun dog show, both Saturday and Sunday afternoon. Capable Canines is now um, just over 10 years old. We started training down in Oruz, we are still there. We now have the unit full time. We have 13 classes a week, both with obedience and agility. And our aim is basically to promote responsible dog ownership and have controlled dogs while they are out in the public. Um, and this event is taking place at Catton Park, which is our August venue. We have fun dog shows running throughout the winter in our indoor unit and also we have a series of agility winter shows. Again, they're indoors, luckily, because we can never quite um, believe the English weather sometimes, so that's indoors. All the dogs are timed by tenth of a second. They have various heights. For the very old dogs, we have micro, then they go to small, then they go to medium, and then they go to large. So it doesn't matter what breed your dog, what age your dog, most of them start doing agility around a year old. But we have dogs starting down at club, they can be six, seven, eight years old. And it's a good, good way to get a bond between you, your dog, and it keeps the dog fit and active, but more to the point, it keeps you fit and active. So we're just going to warm Flint up before he runs in his next competition. All the dogs have to be warmed, get their muscles working. Um, this is Flint, he's a veteran now. He's um, 11 years old now. Had him since he was eight weeks old. He's turned out to be a very, very good dog. And he's won a couple of prizes first thing this morning. And uh, hopefully he'll be consistent again this afternoon. So we'll just put him through a few of his paces and see what he can come up with. Good boy. Um, our next fun dog show is the 19th of August um, and that is at our indoor venue in Oruwas and we're very proud to say the Mayor of Burton is coming to judge that for us and our winter agility season starts in October and will run through until March. Uh, if anybody would like to get involved um, they can contact me on 01283 716892 or email me at jackie at capablecanines.co.uk Our attendance this weekend has been good. The weather has been uh, quite kind to us um, and we hope to have made a good charity effort again for our local charities, which is the RSPCA, which is self-funded, the Rockweiler Animal Welfare and the Border Collie Trust. And as soon as this one is finished, we'll be starting to organise our next one for August, which will be the first weekend in August for 2013.